Bem-vindos à Fortaleza. Day 39 of Around the World for Free. Welcome to Fortaleza, Brazil. So yesterday was the last day in Manaus and I've pretty much given up on seeing any of the giants of the Amazon. So Luli and her friend Giselle took me to a zoo, but it was a little unconventional. The place is called SIGS, which is a jungle warfare training camp. So it's not exactly how I thought I would see these guys, but you know, we're in the Amazon. So we saw the giants of the Amazon, but then it was also mixed in with like soldiers and machine guns. It was very different from anything I've ever seen. Look around the people stand. So then the girls wanted to take me down to the Amazon, so we drove down to the river and hopped on a quick little boat. You can see the colors changing. So although the Amazon starts in Peru, there's a special place in Brazil called the Meeting of the Waters. It's where the Rio Negro meets the Solomois. So our boat took us there and dropped us off. Am I going first? Yeah. And the brave one? I hope there's no anacondas in there. Okay, here we go. It's scary. I feel like there's animals in here that are going to get me. Get out of here. Piranhas. One second is freezing, one second is warm. It's wild in here. So after our swim, the boat takes us down a few little back canals and drops us off at this place where they have Pirado Ku. We're going to see some Pirado Ku. It's a huge fish that live in the Amazon River. I'm going to be terrified right now. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, my God. <laughs> That's what I was just in the water with? They're all just like swarming around. Oh man! Oh. <laughs> Come on, guys! <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> that thing is a beast. We're passing by houses on the river, and we stop at one of these houses. Is there a sloth up there? Yeah. Oh it's man, how funny. funny. How cute. Yeah. Hello, guys. Oh my gosh. Is it anaconda? Can I go in? I can just touch it? I don't want it to attack me. No? Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> This is the jungle anaconda we've been hunting for. Do I look terrified? <laughs> I love him, he's so cuddly. He's so sweet. I'm in love with him. We stopped at this place called Lago Regia de Victoria. We walked down this boardwalk and you see these huge lily pads, which are so, I mean, that's like the image of the Amazon. This is unreal. This is the Queen Victoria, please. So that was the greatest way I could think of to end my time in the Amazon and in Manaus. And Luciana was such a wonderful host. She also arranged for transportation for me to Fortaleza. She got in touch with Mark, who's an exec for Azul Airlines. So he hooked us up with a ticket from here to Fortaleza, leaving tonight at 2 a.m. So this is courtesy of Mark from Azul. Pretty cool. We had one last ice cream together. Thank you so much for everything. Really fun. And then I was on my way. Peace out, Manaus. So Flavio and I have been connecting on the message boards for quite a while. Yeah. Right? My Twitter and CBS.com. Yeah, he's been a good friend of mine via the message boards for a while. So I arranged to come meet him and stay with him and his family here in Fortaleza. It was a long night on the plane, overnight flight, so I landed exhausted. So Flavio was so nice to come pick me up. He brought his friend Corrine and we took off from the airport to go get some breakfast. I'm so tired. I don't know. Huh? And the poor guy, he kept trying to talk to me and I just, I couldn't even form a sentence. I was so tired. So we went to this great restaurant. What was it called? Centro das Tapioqueiras. 
This is where we have a lot of stores who sell tapioca. That is traditional breakfast here in Fortaleza. It was delicious. So after a little breakfast, Flavio took me down through the main drag. There's huge buildings everywhere. Restaurants on the beach in the sand. So we're in a coastal city and it's awesome. Hi. Oi. So Flavio and his family graciously invited me to come stay with them. However, the timing's a little bit off because their house is under construction right now. And then his neighbor, Liliani, invited us to stay at her place, which is right across the street. And it's been really great just having everyone around. Gorgeous house. I like how it's outdoors right here. Yay! Awesome. Muy okay. bon. Obrigada. Thank you so much. <laughs> this is fantastic. Okay guys, so it's a new week. We got a new AT&T poll up for you. Um, this time it's a slice of life in Brazil. So we're choosing between food volley, which is a combination of soccer and volleyball, and how to make a caipirinha, or for me to take a samba lesson. So you guys decide and let me know what you want me to do. So I'm really excited to be here in Fortaleza, hanging out with Flavio, checking out the beach culture here. And as always, stop at cbs.com slash world if you want to get travel updates. That's where all of my photos are. Everything that's going on is going to be there. We talk a lot. Let's go have a swim. Okay. We go swim. Ciao. <laughs>